So we're going to do the global outlook, but let's take a look. Uh, let's start with Africa and what's that, what the update is in Africa. Well, Ivory Coast Defense Minister Ahmed Bakayoko has tested positive for coronavirus and gone into quarantine. Mr. Bakayoko tweeted that he has shown no symptoms before the test and urged citizens to be vigilant. Ivory Coast has so far confirmed two, uh, 323 cases of coronavirus and three people have died. The government has imposed a lockdown in the main city of Abidjan and enforced a nationwide curfew from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. local time. On Saturday, health officials urged people to wear face masks to try to slow the spread of the virus. On phone with me is Marcel. Uh, she's an Ivorian uh, journalist who specializes in health reporting. Hello, Marcel Aka. All right, so when you hear that beep, you know that it's possible you've lost uh, uh, the interviewee. We'll try and reach her back on the line. But so far, we've seen the Ghana situation right there on your screen. And some of you have been sending questions about the number of recovered. You say that you hear over 30, but you see three. Well, you see three because there are others who have been discharged, but they are continuing the treatment at home. And so you cannot necessarily say those people have recovered. They have been discharged to go back home, but they're continuing with the treatment at home. That's why you see the fully recovered as three. Let's go back on the line. Marcel Aka is an Ivorian journalist. He specializes in health reportage. Hello, Marcel. Hello. Well, so we're hearing that uh, uh, one of the top officials in Ivory Coast has tested positive. How has how Ivory Coast taken this development? Okay, in Côte d'Ivoire, we have 62 new cases in patients with coronavirus annotated on April 6, 22, bring to, to 323. The number of cases from the country registered 41, 41 and 6 patients and 3 Three deaf. The population are, are made aware of the importance of barrier measures such as has hand washing and hand hygiene. Respect for distance measures. And it is also recommended to wear the bring towards who have sick or to people who frequent places at risk. The number of passengers has been limited in public transport for the six for six four for taxis including drivers seven for pickup. Containment centers particularly for infectious disease at the University Hospital Centers in Trashville, unlike on the district of Abidjan. And the government is creating voluntary screening, screening seats for the disease. But population, notably in the commune of Yopugo and, in, and Kumasi, still in the district of Abidjan, mm. were opposite because the undercut the government is created instead of containment centers. Right. Well, Marcel, I, very, think, mm. I, I, I think that my English is good, so I know. you understand what I say. I know, we're just uh, managing, uh, we're just uh, ha having to manage with that at the moment. But thank you very much for that update. I think you tried to give us an update of the number of cases that you have so far and how the sensitization is going in Abidjan and how hopefully the government uh, believes this will work, especially with the curfew. But Marcel, thank you very much for that update. Marcel Aka is an idea. Ivorian um, a journalist who specializes in health. Apologies if you aren't able to uh, make sense exactly of what she said because of the accent. But of course, she's an, uh, she's a, uh, uh, a f she speaks French, and so she's just really tried to give us that.